leads Randall to the ball. So Randall starting half forward again, as we saw last week. Providing another tall option for them. Great tackle came from Caitlin Gould. Kick off the deck and Sarah Allen. And a button. Here's a chance trying to break through was Phillips. Under pressure. Coming through. Little gear from Woodland man. She starts the way she finished last week. Ash Woodland draws first blood for the Crows. Uncontested Montana McKinnon. She's an exciting player as well, isn't she? A youngster coming through the SANFLW program. Oh, great tackle there by Jazzy Gagana. Allen is in trouble. This is Najwa Allen. He came from Sarah Allen a little bit before, and the free kick has made a debut last week. Goes to Marinoff inside. She'll look for her left. High ball up, going back, Hatchard, but strong hands in defence, Jazz Garner. She does it all, doesn't she? Give it. Carney comes in hard with a bit of a crunch. Garner taken down, and free kick is going to go Adelaide's way. McKinnon. Stevie Lee Thompson, she's found her way in 50, she's got some space. Down the goal square, it's Woodland, and the kick just fell nice in. Woodland was able to navigate her way through a couple of Kangaroos defenders. Hatchard, and further afield, she's got Mules. And Woodland now, she's got plenty of room, she's going to come back. She's almost going to go behind the mark. Brown knocks her down just as she goes with the kick, but it's in a great position. And Stevie Lee Thompson, but we're seeing some of the... Oh. Defenders like Thompson and Mules mm. working their way forward. Spent a lot of time in defence, but we know she's capable. Stevie Lee, she likes to get on the run and drills it through, and the Crows on a roll. Lexi Hamilton going forward. Little kick. It's worked out okay for the moment. And a couple of bites at it. That is a good take. It was a good kick in there by Gavalis in Tassie for the Ruse. Abitangelo with her kick as she got enough legs on it. I think it might have just got there and the Kangaroos get there first. The kick comes out to Brown. They've got Caitlin Ashmore out wide. And oh, Eloise Jones time. makes some ground. Ashmore was waiting for it. That's that speed. Former volleyballer, Caitlin Gould. Puts the Crows back into attack. Michelle Martin just pushed under the ball. Oh, tries to work her way through. Woodland did well, and Stevie Lee Thompson drills the ball beautifully to Hatchard. First game in for 2022. She missed last week through the health and safety protocols. Quick kick from Charlton forward. Woodland, oh. strong hands. And boy, is she having a purple patch this year so far. We talked about the four goals last week, and here's a chance now. Uh, been a terrific target for them. Ash Woodland and just stabs at the kick and slots through goal number 16 in her 17th game of AFLW. She had a really good first term with a couple of marks. Quick kick, goes forward, still pressure, and here's a chance for the Roos. Just jumping onto it and finishing beautifully. So they've got a goal. A terrific work there by Ali Gavalis. Just very grateful to take that one. Slotted onto her chest here. Oh, going at it. Hatchard and Eloise Jones. Alan Ponta. Ashmore with the tackle. Riddell and Simmons going at it. Couple of ruse. Carney hit hard by Chelsea Randall. Two captains. Ashmore into attack. Fly over the back. Oh, Randall has grabbed her right knee. Keep an eye on that just as she went for that contest. Eight and a half gone. Let's look at Chelsea again. Chelsea Randall and a couple yeah. of goes at it. Najwa Allen. Play on. Set the umpire. Tackle from Randall. Allen in trouble now. Here we go. Garner around the corner. The Roos have got a goal. Chelsea Garner. Opportunistic chance. And they're now within seven points. Charlton. The youngsters combined. Here we go. Hatchard has plenty of time. She's got Emma King chasing her. She's had a couple of bounces. Here we go. She's got Woodland over the top. Oh. And Ash Woodland gets her fourth. Great teamwork. And the Crows 
That made life really tough for the Roos now. The free kick going to go to the Roos. That was Riddell on the bottom of the pack. And there's the siren. Well, a terrific performance by the Crows. They weathered the North Melbourne storm. They were more efficient up forward.